I'm Judy Shaw for NYC Floor Talk, and I'm here at NYC Pacific. Joining me today is Arvin Jane. He is the founder and CEO at Glean. Arvind, it is wonderful to have you here. Thanks for joining me today. Thanks for having me. My pleasure. So now let's start off by talking about Glean. Tell me about the company. Yeah, so think Glean is an enterprise software startup based out of Silicon Valley. Think of Glean like Google or ChatGPT, but for your enterprise. So what Glean does is it connects with all of your enterprise information and data that lives across many different systems within your company. And then it gives you know, your employees one place where they can come and ask any questions that they have. And Glean will answer those questions using all that company knowledge. So that's what we do. Okay. So now you were a distinguished engineer at Google and you spent many years working on search. So tell me, why do search and retrieval technologies play in such a critical role in deploying AI successfully in the workplace? Well, you see, like AI is so amazing. I mean, all of us have probably used ChatGPT or BARD, and you see like how powerful these technologies are. You can come and ask any question, and these tools will somehow figure out the answer to that using all the knowledge that lives you know, within the world. But these tools are, they don't actually know anything about private knowledge inside of a company. And bringing that knowledge to these tools is a very hard problem. Not every company has the ability to take all of your company knowledge and train these models and um, and then sort of you know get that same kind of chat GPT like you know experience within your company, um, and instead the the industry approach that has actually come and become more standard is something that you know where a search engine is actually powering a lot of these AI technologies. So think about you come and ask a question, and the search there's a search engine which is actually going to assemble the right pieces of knowledge for you, um, and then you take that knowledge and the original question and ask the, these AI technologies that, hey, use this knowledge to answer this question. And that's how sort of this technology works and you bring the power of AI in the enterprise. So that's why search is so critical to actually getting all these AI products you know, deployed in your enterprise. Okay, so tell me, what do you believe is the real promise of AI for people at work? Well, our vision and, and also my belief is that very soon in the future, uh, every, every one of us, regardless of our level of experience or seniority in the enterprise, we're going to have a really smart personal assistant that's going to help us do our job. Think of this assistant, somebody with uh, uh, the intelligence of a very smart human, somebody that can actually, you know, that knows about all of your company knowledge that has ever been produced. They've been part of every single conversation that has happened uh, between any two, any two people in the company. And now, they're powered with all of that knowledge. They are sitting next to you 24-7, ready to answer any questions that you have, ready to help you with any tasks that you want to actually complete. And so that's, that's the assistant. AI is actually going to power assistants like, like those in the future for all of us. It's going to change how we work. Okay. When can we expect to see these assistants? <laughs> when do you think? <laughs> well, I believe you know, it's going to come you know, within the next few years. We actually, in fact, like have something, well, we have an assistant today in, at, you know, from Glean, is not like as smart as, as, you know, like a, as I want it to be, but it's all, already incredible. You can actually do a lot of great things you know, with Glean sitting next to you at your work. All right, and finally, Arvin, you're founder of the company. Tell me, what sparked you to start the company? So, the, so before I started Glean, I was uh, the founder of another startup called Rubrik. And we were lucky and fortunate to actually grow that company rapidly and quickly. Uh, but four years in, in that company, we reached a point where our productivity as an enterprise started to go down. People were not able to do as much work as they were able to before. And we would ask them why. Uh, we would actually conduct these um, surveys. Uh, and, and, the, and the number one complaint that I would always see people talk about was, hey, I cannot find anything in this company. I don't know where to go and look for things, and I don't know who to go and ask for help when I need help. So when I saw this, and I'm actually a search engineer by training, like I've worked on search for over a decade at Google before, and my first reaction to that was, I mean, yes, you know, I also face this problem. I also not find anything in this company. I also don't know who to go and ask for help. And the, you know, like, and no wonder, because you know, we have 300 different applications in our company that we use uh, to do our work, and nobody knows you know, what stuff is where. So the first thought that came to my mind was, we should go and buy a search product that would connect all of our company knowledge together. And in that sort of search of finding, finding a search product, 
actually, you know, we didn't land up land with anything. We didn't find any product that could actually solve our problem. And that sort of was the spark for me to actually just go and start clean. All right. Well, Arvind, wonderful to talk with you. Thanks for joining me on Floor Talk today. Thank you for having me.